That's a nice view from up there, actually. You sure he's gonna show up? He better. He promised. Ooh, Sean. Well, if he doesn't find us, we'll find him. I can't believe how much crap you guys have been through. Makes me want to punch in the face each and every asshole that got in your way. Yeah. I'm really gonna try and keep Good my opinions got to, to myself. Meet amazing people too. Life on the road is all about that. The sweet encounters. Hope I can see them again someday. Oh, you will. Tell me about Daniel. What's he like? He's annoying. He's a little rascal. He never stops. Just like you did, you know? Heads up. Is that him? Yep. Wait here. Sean! What happened? What were you thinking, Jake? I didn't know where else to go. Listen, I, I saw Daniel come back to the camp that night. Like he was in shock or something. Then I heard all these sirens and I got scared. I just, I packed a few things. I, I took a blanket from your tent and we, we left together. I also kept the cash you made on the farm. Uh, it's in my car. Oh, so you took my brother and my money. Better me than the cops, don't you think? You have no idea what he looked like when I found him that night, Sean. He was in bad shape, with a gunshot wound, and all by himself. I, I, I couldn't just leave him there. So, you came back here after you escaped, but yeah. with a dazed little boy. Yeah. And everybody was cool with that? Trust me, it was not an easy thing for me to come back. And, yeah, they took us in. That's what they do here. They take people in. Except they didn't want to take me in yesterday. I'm telling you to be careful with the Reverend Mother. She's waited her whole life for somebody like Daniel. Mm -hmm. The Reverend knows how to manipulate people. She's good at this. He wants to stay with her. Daniel has faith in the Reverend now. Did you even try to stop her? Sean, stop it. Why did you think I wrote to your mother? Ugh, come on. There's no way they're gonna let you take him away. Well, too bad. We're not gonna ask for their permission. You must be Jacob. I'm Karen. Hi. Okay. I don't know if you want to do this, but I, I have an idea. I think school must be over by now, but Lisbeth will stay at the church with Daniel for his special classes. That'll give us time to sneak into the compound before we get to them. I'll be on the lookout. Keep watch in case it all goes to shit. Sean, stay on the walkie. Sounds like a plan. One more thing. I, uh, we have to get my sister too. Sarah Lee. <laughs> really, Jacob? Come on, man. She's with your parents. I know. Please, listen, Sean. She's not safe here. She's sick. They believe in everything Elizabeth says. And she says she'll cure Sarah with prayers. I know you understand, right? Damn, Jake. We need his help too, Sean. Okay, Jake. Oh boy. I'm listening. Lisbeth knows what's wrong with Sarah Lee. We just, we need to find her medical record. I think it's in her home office. Then I'll go get Sarah Lee while you get Daniel. Okay? Fine. Sure. I'm gonna trust you on this, Jacob. All good for you, Karen. What if Daniel won't go with you? He will. Mm, I, know him. I don't think so. 
It's gonna take a lot of convincing and he has powers. So he's just going to throw us around and be like, I'm an adult. You don't own me, I can do what I want. Bruh. I ain't got time for all that, boy. Uh, this episode just started and I'm already stressed. Let me do the talking, okay? Yeah, of course. Let's get this over with. Okay, Elizabeth's house is right behind the church, so in and out. Okay. And you sure Elizabeth will have those files on your sister? Watch out, Sean. There are people right outside. Oh, shit. How many? Got it. Thanks. People aren't supposed to come and go around the church once the service is over. Better to avoid them if we can. Okay. Oh, could call her. Hello, young Hackerman. What are you doing here? Oh, uh, hi. We're just... You know you're not supposed to wander around the church once the service is over, right? Right. I, I, I'm i sorry, but we, we were just, uh... Oh, uh, I'm sorry. This is my first time at your church, so he was just showing me around. It's always a pleasure to welcome new members. How come I didn't see you at the service, though? I know, I know. We, we were late, so... We just, uh, watched from upstairs. Come on, you don't have to lie. Everybody knows you hate attending services. Uh, well... Uh... Listen, don't hang around here for too long, okay? I'll talk with your father later. Sure. See you. Okay. Don't you just love it, though, when people can mind their own business? I never really Jeez. understood why people like have to What's go and ask her? questions sometimes, you know? She doesn't seem to like you very much. That's because I left the church. She's not the only one that's pissed at me. Sorry to... No one's in sight. Good. Sorry to hear that. Yeah, Jacob seems nice. I think he lacks a little bit of... Some type of form of intelligence like kind of like street this smart Daniel's room he doesn't really seem street oh, smart damn. Karen everything all right Be careful, though. Can't believe Daniel really lives in this depressing house. Okay. I just, I hope they're not onto us. Yeah. Let's haul ass. Where are the files? Right there, in her office. Ugh. Of course it's locked. Her open door speech is just another lie. We gotta find a way in. Fuck. Think there's a key somewhere? Maybe she's too cautious not to have a spare set around. <sighs> Whoa. The evenings in here must be so much fun. Are you okay, Jake? Yeah. Yeah, no. It, it's just so full of memories and stuff. Oof. And I thought Claire and Steven were old fashioned. I would like to know more about what, what Jake is feeling about. Coaxing lesson one. Get Daniel his favorite cereal. Mm. 
Whoa. This place is worse than army camp. Like, why did he decide to come back? Did he think, like, that was his only choice in order to help Daniel, or Daniel's did he know? Daniel's much more sense now. Did he know that, like, what was going to happen to Daniel? And he told them about his this powers. a lot of pills. Especially for someone who doesn't believe in science. That's a good point right there. She sure likes to gaze at her own success. I definitely want to know more about what Jake is feeling Whoa. about right now. They kicked her out of church? Now they're thirsty. I'm a little confused by that letter. Don't see anything of interest. Oh, shit. Looks like the Reverend Mother got this letter before Jake. Wow. Okay. I found a key. Good. Let's try it. Okay. What the? She's completely obsessed with his power. Hey, I found your letter for Jacob. Too bad Lisbeth found it first. Ew. Nothing here. Oh. Interesting, okay. Nothing interesting. That walkie is really just gonna stand up there and now I can't call her. <laughs> is this Daniel's room? Yeah. Man. It's depressing. Well, Lisbeth doesn't believe in material possessions, so. Doesn't mean you need to decorate your house like a prison. Is she forcing him to do this? Why is he accepting all that? For real. Sean, is everything all right in there? Uh, yes. We're trying to get into her office. She's locked it up, so it has to be there. Fine. I'll let you know if I see anything unusual. <sighs> Yes, that's the one. Oh, perfect. Whoa. Is this her personal archive or something? Yeah, she keeps track of everything in here. Stuff about my sister must be in this one. Okay, I've got something. Must be what you're looking for. She has pneumonia? And for what I get, Lisbeth knows damn well she needs medical treatment. That's criminal. She's insane. Look, she has a file on you too. <laughs> you can take a peek and see how she really treats her flock. Man, mm, what's all this? Were you like... Sick? Conversion therapy? Do they... Wanted to cure you from... Being... 
pretty much. I always showed more interest in boys than girls. Mm, Jacob. <laughs> they thought I was a freak. A sinner. Didn't you... tell your parents? <laughs> you kidding? They wanted her to do that. Mom and Dad thought I had a demon inside. So did I. I really did believe I was a sinner, so I thought I had to atone for my sins. And, uh, how did that go? Not good. I just prayed all the time and stopped hanging out with boys, girls, everybody. I got depressed, paranoid. Damn, Jake. After a few years, I was in a really bad place. I, I tried to hurt myself. Elizabeth was very upset. We had a long chat. She told me I should leave. Go see the world and figure things out. I, I don't really get her, Sean. But Elizabeth does believe in all of this stuff. I had no clue about your life here. I'm... I'm sorry, Jake. I'm sorry I brought Daniel here. I was just so blown away when I saw what he could do. It was like a real miracle. I, I thought I'd, I'd found my faith again. Instead, I, I just heard him. Then let's make things right. We just have to get Daniel out of here. I hope so. And I'll get my sister to a hospital. Have her treated. I hope I he can just, her. like, live with her. Like, he should be the one that, you know... Keep our mind. Take care of her, you know? For your sister. She I needs think it. he oh, needs I, that. I can't do that, I think Sean. he needs her. That, that That's a lot of... We're okay. It will cover her medical bills. Wow. Thank you, Sean. Sean, are you there? <sighs> What's up? You got company. That thug who works for Elizabeth. A woman just spoke with him. Now he's coming your way. This guy is dangerous, Sean. Trust me. Hey, I have a good plan to get him out of your way. He'll give you more time. Just give me the word. Yeah. See what you can do. I will. Get ready. Sean, we gotta hide. Now. Hurry up. I don't know what I'm doing on God. <laughs> There's multiple places to hide, but I don't know. Come on, Sean, we need to hide. I hope that was a good place. Man, if he finds us here, we're screwed. I don't know what Jake's doing. I hid in the closet. Everybody hides in the closet. He's definitely gonna find me. Hey, I know you're somewhere in here. And if I find you... Mm. He's gonna find me. It's the closet. Everybody hides in the closet. Yep, see? Huh? What? What the fuck is going on? Guess not. Sean, do you think it's gotta be Karen? Oh, he's gone. Let's get out of here. Oh, man, that was crazy. 
I really thought he was going to catch us. The guy's leaving. Looks like my diversion worked out. <sighs> yeah. Nice job. <sighs> Seriously, how can she ignore that? Mm-mm-mm. Okay, we shouldn't be here. Are you ready? Mm, I don't think there's anything worth a look in here. Okay, let's go. Poor Jacob. Look I'm really that. sad he had to go through that. Your mom is hardcore, Sean. Yeah. I guess she is. So we're all good now? I'll go get Sarah Lee while you get Daniel. Then let's meet up at the car, okay? All right. You be careful, okay? You too, Sean. Good luck. Do we end up meeting up with him and the sister? I don't even remember. Come in, Karen. See anything? No, you're all clear. Awesome. Talk later. So I wonder if we went on the other side where the guy was playing with the kid if he would have told the goon as well, or if it was just a lady. Mission accomplished? Yep. Oh. Now the hard part. Did you find what Jacob needed? Huh. And a whole lot more. So you know what you're gonna do? No. But let's do it. All we could try to do is just convince Daniel. Oh Lord, let your power speak through this young vessel. I am your humble sure. servant and will obey what the hell your is this? every command. Speak to me. It's Daniel. I told you he's kind of special. Hey, Sean, you came back. And I know, little cub. Come with me, Daniel. We're leaving. I'm sorry, Sean. I can't. She's full of shit, dude. And she's using you. Daniel has made his choice, Sean. But I'm offering you to join us again. Put your faith in me. And you'll be family. Never. So that's your final decision. May the Lord have mercy on your lost soul. It's time for you to leave our sanctuary. Right now. Not without my brother. I'm not going anywhere. This is my home. She's my family now. Daniel. Listen, she's not your family. Sean, who is she? Bro, our Karen mother. brought out her mom voice real quick, eh? She came here for you. Oh, praise the Lord. Another miracle at our church. One is he all good? See, is that manipulation, bro? <laughs> it's all right, Daniel. Go see her. I mean, she's right there. Don't be afraid. I... I don't know her. Of course. I know. This is hard for you, my son. Stop calling him that. You're just manipulating him, you sicko. <laughs> That's in the eye of the beholder. But since you are his mother, let me ask you. How could you let your child wander alone in the wilderness? Where were you when Daniel was lost? Where? Listen, Daniel. I came here as soon as I found out you were here on your own. I'm not on my own. Children are a gift from the Lord. They are a reward from him. You were blessed with a divine gift. And you cast him out into the world. Who the hell are you? You might have been his mother once. 
But when you abandoned him, you also gave up your rights. Isn't your god all about forgiveness? Mm-hmm. You have no idea what the Bible says. How can you pretend to care about these two children? You left them and your husband to seek out your base desires. Daniel, honey, she's trying to trick you. Please, think by yourself. You're smarter than this. Daniel, she's responsible for what happened to your father. You don't know anything. It was an accident. That's what this world is about. Accidents, injustice, pain. I'm just so sorry, Daniel. I know. I know how much I hurt you and your brother by leaving. I know that's not enough, but I hope we can talk about this together. That's what I've been trying to tell your brother, and I'm so glad he listened. But you gotta trust us. She's using you for her selfish desires. Daniel, this time the choice is yours. Are you going to believe her or me? I... Uh, I... That's right. You can't tempt Daniel from this garden. He'll stay with us, his true family. And we'll never leave him. Come on, Daniel, man. Go to hell. Come on, Daniel. No! See, you're so quick to use that power. Like, you need to stop, bro. Like, enough's enough. Reverend, are you okay? Nicholas, they're, they're heretics sent to desecrate our, our church. Okay, what now? Don't you understand? This is over, Sean. You have to talk to him. You can convince him, Sean. I won't leave you, Daniel. Not here. Don't be so stubborn, Sean. Your brother chose his path. Your friend, Sara Lee, she's very sick. And Lisbeth won't take her to a doctor. What? She wouldn't do this that. This is pointless. Daniel knows who to trust. A minister from another church even sent her a letter, warning her that she's taking too much risk that Sarah needs to see doctors. But I don't want Sarah Lee to be hurt. Have faith in me, Daniel. I know what I'm doing. Oh God, God is speaking to me and to you. This, this is a toxic community. She's cutting everyone from the world, keeping things secret. She wants to keep you to herself. It's better like that. At least I'm not hurting anyone anymore. Dude, Ouch. you don't have to hurt people. You Just control your, your home anger. Here, Daniel. Don't let him trick you. I found a letter from Karen, her mother, inside her house. She hid it from you. So you never know. She's looking for you. What? You told me she didn't want to see me. Uh, see what you have done? Hey, Inano. Uh, Back off. No one is going to keep me away from you. I said stop! Uh, don't. I came all this way for you. And nobody will stop me. I'll even cross hell or whatever if I need. Ugh. Sean! He must learn. That's not how you learn, bro. Come on. Ooh, that's a nasty little gas you got there, Listen, Sean. I did my best job to be a good brother. And I know I probably failed. I took you for granted. I put you in danger. And I'm sorry. Sean. Don't listen to him. He, he left you just like that harlot did. Shut him up. He can hit me as much as he wants. I won't give up on you. Don't hate him. <clears throat> Don't let them do that, Daniel. 
Come on, Sean, we ain't giving up like that. Come on, man. If I could go back in time, I would. We'd be in our living room in Seattle. That would get us pizza. And I only have one good eye left. Don't hit me there. Because we would always fight about it. He always picked your movie. But I can't do that. All I can do now is fight. Quiet! What are you waiting for? We're the best team in Anu. Stop so it! We have to keep going no. forward. What are You're you gonna doing? kill him? Please! He's my brother! You can burn down our church, but not our faith. Daniel knows you're telling the truth. Don't give up. Come on, Sean. You gotta do it for your brotherhood, man. Nothing, nothing is gonna stop me, Daniel. We're brothers. Dad always said our blood link was the most important thing. You know it. Please, stop. Leave him alone, Daniel. Listen to him. Daniel, if there's ever a time to actually use your powers, now would be the time. Come on, man. I won't stop. No matter what she does. I'll come right back. Again. And again. <coughs> That's right, Sean. I love you, Daniel. I That's right, Sean. Show Daniel what actual power looks like. Shut him up! Now! Don't move. Just stop. If you want to kill me, then do it. I'm not afraid. Do it! Shoot! Don't! Go ahead. Why don't you give her the gun? should not be staying in the burning building for that long. Oh no. No. You started this fire. You will all burn in this hell. As long as you're gonna burn Move. with us and I honestly Let don't care go. at this point. Move it. You won't leave this place. Not with me alive. threaten me with death. I embrace it. I know what awaits me. See, asking Daniel could go one of two ways. One is to say Daniel just like shoo her off to the side. Or two, Daniel Killer. And I don't want to put that on Daniel. But I don't want Daniel to see me kill somebody with a gun. But I'm not going to put that on Daniel, I guess. I'm sorry. Oh. Watch, Daniel's probably saying, you did what you had to do. It was her or us. Like, he doesn't even look phased, girl. I think Daniel's long gone now. Can 
Can we get Daniel a new haircut and out of that clothes, please? It's so quiet because I ain't got no copyright music playing. Oh, he ended up surviving? You dog. Evil is hard to die. Okay, we did meet up with them. Just want Daniel to say goodbye to Elizabeth at least, yeah. I think Jake really needs his sister right now. I think having her and like potentially raising her would probably like heal him in a lot of ways. And I don't mind giving him the money to help him heal, you know? Because at this point, I think they need the money more than us. So far, Jacob's ending is the only one I'm happy about with this episode. <laughs> All right. You passed one of the tests. Yeah, I'm sorry, but that pen one, the pen, whatever it's called, the pen one was hard to do. Told the age of forest robbery. Heck yeah, I was telling it was Finn's idea. I don't care about him, please. He was selfish. Look at the trouble that we're in because of him. I literally lost Daniel because of him. I had to kill someone because of Finn, please. You escaped the hospital without hurting anyone. Aww. Joey could have helped us. That's interesting. See, I was trying to figure out how to attack the guard, but I didn't know how to do that one. Now, how do I not get asked to sing a song? That one, I don't know. I was not giving money to the church. Imad, please. It was a regular church. That's something different. This was a cult. Yeah, I let, I let Karen have her moment. So yeah, I think if I went and played, no, if I went in on the other side where the guy was playing with his kid, I don't think Nicholas would have been aware. Yeah, these endings, I don't know how I could have gotten that one or any of those ones. Because I feel like Daniel just would have killed her. I don't know how I could have gotten Daniel to spare her.
This is it. We made it, Daniel. What do we do now? Make our way across. That's the wall. You ready? Yeah. I think. <laughs> 